There's only three taken. Am I crazy? Oh, there's still one at top. Interesting. Mm. Oh, that's because Kurosi oh, cool. Kurosi's getting chased. Hester Joe and company. Goodness me, oh my. A, uh, maybe the mana region aura and heal creep would be really good in this lane for damage. That's a lot of damage, but he is staying oh, alive. Strike. Bottom lane into the telekinesis. Inkswell will stun, but Zidrax taking a huge amount of damage, and that is going to be a death for our Razor today. Grim H on the high ground here is going to be trading again with the Grimstroke. Of course, he does have the level advantage for now. And Sand King's going to come in. Mind Control does have Burrow Strike. Very low range at level one. We'll get it off, and that is going to be another kill for Team Nigma in this bottom lane. So both. Indeed. So have some good net worths on the board. Yeah, Weeha taking more spells to the face. Thunder Strike. Oh, Kinetic Field is there, and this looks to be a kill for Singularity. And Kuroki just a little bit late, and won't be able to do a whole lot in terms of damage. Uh, what do you think of the Invoker TA matchup, just generally speaking? Is going to have Sand King taking some damage here. That looks to be an easy kill, actually, for Singularity. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's not a draw. Mm -hmm. Oh, Excalibur. Oh, Miracle oh, getting initiated double. on. Glimpses there. Sunstrike will take Very out the Disruptor nice. first, though. Oh, man. But Excalibur uh, still won't be too sad about this. It's hard to get both of the first outposts at the same time. It is hard, yes. It is possible with the right coordination, especially if you're facing a, a type of lineup that isn't strong at protecting the zones right now, like if they have a really greedy hero, like Alchemist or whatever. Uh, but it's hard to make the right hero split. You need a lot of information, right? Because let's say you split two and three, and the enemy team has like four on one shrine. Whichever of your two or three men squads goes there, it dies and loses the fight. So. Oh dear, the duel comes out. It's not going to be a successful one, but he, Weeha is surrounded by enemies. And Disruptor was the target of choice, but he's not going to be able to find it. So it will cause his death. A little bit weird to see him on that side of the map, but I'm sure he had his instant smoke. And Mind Control also died before this to, I believe, the Razor. Yep, another glimpse into the kinetic field. Such a strong combination. And GH did steal Refraction, but will only delay the inevitable. As a tier 1 tower looks to be taken out as well, as Razor actually gets killed in the top lane. The Grim oh, that's a good ward. The ward. That's a good ward. Yeah. Sorry, we got a dog boy. recently. So. I hear the MP? Sand King ult rocking in the commander, and Weeha with the Sun Strike as well. Able to take him out with those Fury Swipes. Gonna have the Grimstroke ult come into play now as the TP comes in from Zitrak. So they're gonna be able to clean up the Rubik and the Chen. So despite losing the Legion Commander, able to take out both supports in quick succession. So you need to deal with this area very well. Nice glimpse, sends GH yeah. all the way packing, and that should be Roche. Unless... It's pretty low. Mind Control comes in with the Burrow Strike, but Zitrax here to help his teammate out. Tessa Joe did fall. Roshan is very low. It's a two-for-one exchange. Excalibur does get the Aegis as well as the Roshan kill. We are going to play all this pressure to Excalibur now, so this looks to be a consumed Aegis here very shortly, but Zitrax has something to say about that. Plasma Field goes up, but he dies shortly after. Aegis does get consumed. Double buyback from Singularity, and Team Nigma only losing the Sand King right now. Which probably goes to Miracle, and okay, that's bad. Oh boy, that's that's real bad. Into the Epi, and TA does get pressed the attack, but she is done so. Looks like an item actually dropped, a Dragon Scale. That we're Thank learning. You. I really appreciate the, the lessons here today, my friend. Disruptor, uh, mind control. Yeah, he's All dead. right, Burrow Strike into the Sun Strike, and that's an easy one. Pop. An outpost. Yeah, that's the dream right there. Boy, oh boy. I'm sure he'll find his way back. Disruptor able to get the glimpse. Here's the duel, and Kuroki will be killed. Very close. First shot over and over. Notice, by the way, that did, did you mention that Miracle rushed Axe? Sure didn't, but Mind Control gets off the epicenter into the Sun Strike. Excalibur at half HP, getting very low. Pops the BKB finally will apply all his pressure to Mind Control. He gets healed up by Kuroki. Looks like the final pick up that kill. GH looks to be dead as well. So two for nothing to start this fight. Weeha getting dueled, and he might get the damage out of this. It's going to be close. Nope. Able nice to man. kite him as usual. Three for nothing now. As singular as Exor. I mean, when I first... Oh, we're going to see a glimpse, glimpse here onto GH. Oh, quick blink. They didn't follow up on it. 
Oh, they got greedy. Away they go. Oh, boy. Oh, greed will be your downfall. Yes, it will. Miracle gets the command at least. EMP. And there's a double burrow strike, and that is a very dead Grimstroke. The fight commences, though. Weehaw getting pounded upon by Zitrax. Pops that ult is very fast. A lot of damage was stolen. They're going to be able to clean up mind control, so it's a one for one to start this fight. There's a glimpse finally in. Oh, again, again, GH able to blink. Goodness. Just getting these off so quickly. Miracle still has the Sun Strike. Gets off the Cold Snap as well. Oh my god. That was hilarious. Good now they're going to get the Tornado on top of Hesta Joe's. The buyback onto the Disruptor. We're not going to get here in time though. Bit of a panic buyback. He didn't even have a tower yeah. to pull. Uh, Weeha glimpse back into the pit, but we'll just hop on out like the little bunny rabbit he is. That means we need a bunny rabbit cosmetic for Ursa. Somebody get on that immediately. Excalibur gets Burl struck. Weeha pops that ult. There comes the tomato, or the meatball, I should say, even better. Grimstroke able to get the ult off. Weeha very hard to double kill right now. Finally drops. And the double duel comes in tow as Hesta Joe and company able to clean up a couple of members of Team Nigma. So a good fight for them, but it did cost them some buybacks. Although yeah, who did they buy the back? The, they bought back the Disruptor prematurely, and then this Legion. time they bought, they brought back Legion in the fight. Um, oh, GH, Miracle, they're gonna try. All right, he has press, he'll be okay. Maybe not. Is that Cataclysm, son? No. Okay. Okay, it's not okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, was it, uh, who was it given to? I think Ursa has it for now. No, he passed it on to Rubik, I guess? Dying. Yeah, Rubik's Dying. carrying it, but he's not using it yet. All right, Miracle. He is getting so oh much God. info right now. Oh boy, Citrax. He should get Cataclysm right now on that stun. Oh, they were oh. expecting the four stars, I guess. Attack keeps him alive. A nice ult from Grimstroke again. I think he's able to capitalize on this, though, as Weeha applies all his pressure to Zitrax. Pop that BKB that's not doing too much good here against the right clicks of that fat, juicy bear with the cowboy hat. And now Grimstroke looks to be dead as well. So a two for nothing to start this fight. As GH looking for more. Disruptor. Ends up getting the glimpse out, but Weeha is here along with my control. And that is going to be oh, a double kill nice, for Weeha. nice, actually, that Ursa can do that now. It's nice that he can choose to jump into it. That's pretty cool. Miracle. Has yet to use Cataclysm, by the way. I, I'm going to say he doesn't know. I mean, what, what other reason would you get Aghanims? Mm, he might not have felt like there's a situation where he could use Cataclysm well because of the Force Staff, right, on the enemy team. But right, we'll see if he uses it once by the end of this game. Sun Strike, so no. Still has not. Cataclysm okay, this has no a longer cooldown. There is a trade off, right? Cinderin, you don't buy Ags then. I'm sorry, this, there's no way you buy Ags. Is he winning or are you winning? Cataclysm once. Sure. Who's winning here? I'm winning. I'm pretty sure I'm winning yep. right now. This argument. The one where yes. I like. Yeah. That's kind of what the shovel feels like. Paper this is Grandpa. Detector. Grandpa's out with his shovel and he just keeps finding fucking TP scrolls. He's like, I wish I found a gem. But you always just find TP scroll. Not a literal gem, but a bounty gem is what you want. Oh, of course. He's getting initiated on. He's gonna pop his ult. Staying alive for now. Weehaw getting drained. Mask of Madness pop as well. Zitrax doing a lot of damage, but that is just the Aegis. Chen buys back into the game, see if he can get into the fray or not. GH kind of stuck in the tree here. Looks like he's gonna go down as a Grimstroke ult comes out as well. And the fight continues as Razor getting applied all the pressure from Weeha. He's just continue to own right now. A duel target is dangerous. Is, yeah, it is, but Weeha's very low. Nobody's going to win the duel. And both heroes will die pretty much simultaneously. And now Miracle looks to be on the run as Singularity has the numbers. Good Let's get the Ghost Walk off. Excalibur just needs another right click, but they're not going to get vision. So away he goes. And back, Kuro. Kuro. back to the battle. Absolutely. I'm back, Miracle. Best. Okay, buddy. Good boss. Oh, I love this. I want to commend Hestajo on this. He actually tipped an enemy player for a good play and not for fucking up. Good job. Yeah. I love or something. That's like not that. true, Cinder. I would never do such a thing. I'm a sure. very good teammate. Oh, okay. All right. That is a static. He's completely alone. He is. Yes. I, thought, I think there was definitely some miscommunication. They wanted uh, to fight, but yeah, not able probably. to. He has buyback available. Ursa. Sunstrike. Going for, oh, the Sunstrike. Oh, wow. Double kill for Miracle. Still no Cataclysm in case you were wanting. Burrow Strike comes into play as well. Razor gets off the BKB. See if the buyback comes from, from Disruptor or not. Of course, he doesn't have Static Storm, so I guess his use is a bit limited. As Miracle and company now going for the tier 3 middle. There's the buyback on Disruptor. Static Storm still has the 8 second BKB right now. 
And Miracle and Kes, again, just to remind you guys, still has Cataclysm available. We have Ice Wall coming in now. Miha jumps in, going for Kit Zitrax, I should say. This would be a, an essential dieback, and it essentially is. 110 seconds on the deck. And the next looks to be Legion Commander as Team Nigma look to be taking this series, although it's not quite over yet, I suppose. They do have that bottom lane of Rax. Looking for this mid now. Alacrity was applied to Weeha. That's a good way to take these buildings. Fortification. They accounted, they, they accounted for that. They know they have two TPs, so they can do that. They can use this glimpse. Oh, man. And that is a, another death here, this time for Grimstroke. Nice static storm onto three heroes, but not going to be a whole lot of follow-up. Duel is available to use. Weeha. Stunning Excalibur and Decimate. It took like five right clicks to take him out. Good God, Weeha. And still, no Cataclysm in case... Oh, there he goes! Finally, he does it! I can't believe it! It's the GG maker for Miracle. A triple kill and a kill now for Weeha. He knew it, Shannon.